Hi, I'm Cynthia Mann, and we're here today at Birch Fabrics in Paso Robles, California. This is also the home of Fabricorum.com. Hi, I'm Melissa London, and the resident seamstress here at Birch Fabrics. I teach sewing lessons here, prepare blog tutorials, and sew samples of Birch's line of organic cotton. And I'm here today to talk to you about sewing. So now we're going to talk about how to sew corners. And that would be if you're going to sew a basic pillow. What you want to do is have your two layers of fabric. This is our little mini pillow. And you want your fabric pieces lined up perfectly. And then you put them under your presser foot. And you, mark, you follow along with your seam allowance. And you're going to sew along one side. If you're using a 5 8 seam allowance, you're going to stop 5 8 from the next side of the pillow. You can make a little mark before you start so you don't overshoot it. And then what you want to do is make sure that your needle is in the down position, which means that it's through the fabric. And then you're going to lift up your presser foot and then rotate your fabric 90 degrees. And if you are a little bit too far away from the edge, you can just swing it back. Do one more stitch by turning the hand wheel, lift it up, and then put the fabric 90 degrees and continue sewing. And that's how you do the first part of sewing a corner. Once you are finished, you can see that you have a nice corner, but when you flip it right side out, it's gonna be a little bulky and you're gonna just trim that corner off like that. And then when you turn your corner right side out, you kind of use your finger, sort of poke it straight and take a pin and very, very gently, so you don't rip your stitches, kind of just pull out that corner so it's nice and sharp and then you'll press it and you will have a perfect 90 degree corner.